The Ghana National Association of Teachers, NAT, is asking governments to ensure rural communities receive the much-needed development as the country is on high alert against terrorist activities. The association believes this is one of the ways to prevent people, including teachers and school-going children, from falling prey to offerings from terrorist groups more. In this report, as the National Security Ministry took its See Something, Say Something campaign to the NAT headquarters. Tuesday, May 24, 2022, government launched an awareness campaign dubbed See Something, Say Something. The move was to put Ghanaians on high alert against terrorist activities. They have since been engaging stakeholders, the latest of which is the Ghana National Association of Teachers. Here is the national coordinator for the national security, Major General Retired Francis Edu Amanfo. Indeed. Teachers are the makers of a nation, hence they play a cardinal role in nation building and national development. Perhaps a deeper reflection of a country without teachers would give us a better appreciation of the importance of teachers. Implicitly, without teachers, the development of a nation's human capital will be non-existent, a situation which would lead to high literacy rate, high unemployment, and an unskilled and dysfunctional society. And certainly, these are the core factors of national security, of stability of any nation. If we lack all of these, our nation stands to lose and stands at big risk. If we can preserve our peace and stability, we can be assured of an enabling environment so that you and I can go about our routine and normal duties with peace and tranquility. President of the Ghana National Association of Teachers, Reverend Isaac Owusu, is asking government to provide rural communities with the needed social amenities. I think it's, it's very important for us as a nation uh, to look at how we are distributing the national cake. Uh, in fact, if you take Ghana as a whole and looking at the distribution of the national cake, you could see that uh, some people are not happy, especially uh, if you look at those working within the deprived areas of this country. The, the social amenities are not there. General Secretary of the Association, Thomas Musa says government must ensure the welfare of teachers and students to prevent them from being radicalized by the office of terrorist groups. You see, there is a scripture in the Bible saying that don't let me become poor so that I'll be tempted. So temptation is everywhere. Even in the Lord's Prayer, we say that lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Temptation is always with us and evil is always present. And the only way that we can help I mean, we can help get, uh, get our children protected is by providing them the basic necessities of life. So some things like feeding, the infrastructure, and things that will help them, basic things that will help them live their normal life, particularly in underserved communities, I believe that they should be provided. Because if you don't do it, and an individual comes in to provide these things for them, certainly the, that particular individual can end up indoctrinating them and whatever the person tells them, they will end up getting, I mean, doing it. And that will not be safe for us. Members of the general public are encouraged to report all suspicious activities to the national security by dialing 999. For Joy News, Michael Ashali.